Hi everyone, today I'll share some basic editing if in case you would like to create your own YouTube intro or opening billboard, also known as OBB. With this, we are going to use PixArt, Motion Portrait, VN Video Editor, and InShoot. Let's begin. The first application I'm going to use is PixArt. Click Open. and go to their home page. You will see a lot of templates and how you would like to present your own artwork. For this tutorial, I'm going to use this. You will see here the preview of the process that you need to undergo. Hence, you can tweak or modify. Click try to proceed. Choose the photo you would like to use. Below, you will see that there are six steps to get our finished product. The first step is the cutout. Click this eye icon for you to check the quality of your cutout. Use eraser if there's some excess. Once you're done, click next. Step number two is where you can find the effects section. Here you have a lot to choose from. For this tutorial, I'm going to use Magic Bad Nights. You can modify the percentage here. Once you're done, go to step number three. Under Recent, click None. If you're decided to proceed with Magic Bad Nights, if not, then you can choose additional effects. Click next for step number four, where you can modify the ratio, color, background, etc. For ratio, click square. Choose the color and or background you would like to use. Then proceed to step number five, where you can add object or objects. For this tutorial, I'm going to remove suggested objects. Step number six, you will be asked again to choose effects. If you would love to, then click tools, crop, and for this, I'll go with circle. Here, you can modify the size of the frame. Click save. Once you are done editing, the main art for your OBB, here's the hack or shortcut for you to create green screen effect. Go back to step number four, where you can hide the image that you choose earlier, then choose the shade of green. Once you're done, proceed to step number five, then remove again the objects. Click next to proceed to step number six. Do not include any effects and save. Now go to InShoot, click photo, Select the green background created. Go to Canvas to modify the ratio. Set it to 16 by 9. Once you're done, go to Sticker. Select the photo created earlier. Overlap the photo at the green background. Save. Then go to Motion Portrait. Click the overlap image created in InShot. In Motion Portrait, it will animate the eyes and lips of your photograph. You can choose here the emotions you would like to project. Make sure you mute the microphone option below. Once everything is all set, click the record button. Up to you how many seconds you would like to record the animated portrait. Once done, click Save. Now go to your album or camera roll, then edit the motion portrait created. Remove some excess frame or edit the ratio. Once done, go to VN Video Editor application. Make sure you have a particular background to overlap the green screen motion portrait. Import it to the canvas of VN. On top, under sticker section, select the created green screen. Position it to your canvas. Once done, click mask. Choose radial. The length of the background should complement the length of your green screen. 
make sure you have allowance of 3 seconds up front and at the end of your background. Once done, export. For our final app, go to InShot. Import your file video. In editing, take note of the following. Number one, sequencing. Sequencing is very important because it provides the story or content. Cut the spot in the visual where you are going to insert the text and or stickers. Second is the audio. In this tutorial, we are going to use a music pad. And sound effects to give life to the visual. Always make sure that you sync your visual to your music bed and or sound effects to get your desired result. Third is transition. Click your text and or stickers if you have and put proper transition for impact. Once done, export. Then view your masterpiece. Thank you for watching.